Hi friends, in this video we will learn how to use the multi-line text annotation in AutoCAD 2016. You can find the multi-line text annotation in the annotation panel. Here you can see the text. From the drop-down menu, choose the multi-line text. It will ask for the first corner. So select this and specify the opposite corner for example I choose here now it will display the text editor in the specified area now you can type the content your text here You can continuously enter your text in this column and it will automatically force it to the next line when it reaches the end of the column. To quit from this command, you can press outside the drawing. And if you want to edit this text again, you can select it again. You can see here it is, this all lines are considered as a single object. You can edit to this multi-line annotation by choosing the grip. If you want to move this text to the right side, you can click and drag this grip and you can place it to anywhere as you like. I am keeping this text here again and if you want to change the width of this text you can click and drag this grip towards the left or right so it will automatically adjust the width if you want to change the column height you can use this bottom grip which will force this text to enter in the second column so when I move this grip it will the text will be forced to the second column if you want to edit this text you can double click on the text then the text editor will be available again then you can change the text also and you can use the normal word processor for example if you want to change the text font text style you can change bold italic and you can use the normal justification and paragraph numbering most of the commands that uh, you are using in microsoft word and notepad you can use in this multi-line text annotation also thanks for watching if you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel.